Jerry Harris won the hearts of fans with his famous Matt Talks. Enthusiastically supporting his cheerleading teammates as they pursued another championship title on the popular Netflix series Cheer. But now Harris is under arrest, appearing in court Thursday, accused of repeatedly asking a 13 year old to produce sexually explicit videos and photographs of himself. According to a criminal complaint, Harris is accused of contacting twin brothers who were 13 when he was 19. One of the boys telling investigators he sent Harris explicit photos and videos. In one instance, Harris allegedly responded to a photo of him doing a cheerleading move on Snapchat asking the teen to, quote, do it naked and take a video and show me. The other boy says he refused Harris's advances. During an interview this week with law enforcement, the complaint says Harris confirmed explicit exchanges with the brothers and admitted to attempting to entice one of them to perform oral sex, as well as soliciting and receiving child pornography on Snapchat from at least between 10 to 15 other individuals he knew were minors. The twin brothers were not named in court documents, but they spoke about the alleged abuse to USA Today. What everyone is seeing of Jerry Harris from the outside view from social media is a completely different person from when you actually know him. The family's feeling a lot of relief today. A civil lawsuit was filed against Harris earlier this week on behalf of the twin brothers. Before his arrest, a spokesperson for Harris said, we categorically dispute the claims made against Jerry Harris, which are alleged to have occurred when he was a teenager. We are confident that when the investigation is completed, the true facts will be revealed. Known for his big personality on Cheer, Harris became an overnight sensation, appearing on Today. Interviewing celebrities as a red carpet correspondent for Ellen. I feel to be the coolest man in the world. Really? Is that what I got? Yeah. Even sharing the stage with Oprah. And Harris's team has not requested, or actually have not responded to our request for comment regarding the latest charge. We did hear back from Netflix, and they told NBC News, like everyone, we are shocked by this news. Any abuse of minors is a terrible crime, and we respect the legal process. Harris remains in custody. He's due back in court on Monday. If he is convicted, he could face up to 30 years in prison. Uh, mean, meantime, Kathy, one of Harris's co-stars is speaking out about the case. Hoda, that's right. Monica Aldaba, who is also prominently featured on the Netflix show and is the coach and worked closely with Harris, also released a statement saying, my heart is shattered into a million pieces. I am devastated by the shocking, unexpected news. Our children must be protected from abuse and exploitation, and I'm praying hard for the victims and everyone affected. Please respect our privacy as our family mourns during this time. All right, Hoda? Kathy Park. Kathy, thank you.